A Rhode Island religious leader is hoping to lead his church into the 21st century by harnessing the power of Facebook and Twitter to spread his message to the masses. Eyewitness News reporter Andrew Adamson has our story new at five. There's a new bishop in Rhode Island with a very particular set of skills. Meet the man using social media to take church to a new level. Right Reverend Nicholas Nisley says times are tough for churches both locally and nationally. He's seen a trend of declining attendance in recent years. Churches are merging, some churches are closing. So what's one of the best ways to grow and reach the masses in the technology age? Social media sites like Facebook and Twitter. Both of them are ways that we reach out to people who are looking for churches, looking to ask questions about religion. When the Episcopal Diocese of Rhode Island was on the hunt for their next bishop, a strong online communicator became a prerequisite. That's why they turned to a social media enthusiast. I've been one of the trailblazers in communications and online communications since the church started using it back in the mid-80s. When Nisley was ordained last week, he became one of just 10 bishops in the Episcopal Church around the country on Twitter. He says he wants to maintain an online presence to be able to answer questions at a moment's notice. You get an unfiltered voice from people in the congregation. I get to hear their questions without a sense of, oh, I'm talking to the bishop. The bishop actually says that religious questions are actually the second most searched on the internet. To find out how you can get in touch with the bishop, head over to our website, WPRI.com. In the newsroom, Andrew Adamson, Eyewitness News.